What's up guys? So I'm here to talk about the Nike Epic React Fly Knit running shoe that just came out with the first colorway on um, Monday the 5th. Um, February 5th that is. And um, I got a chance to get the first colorway on that day. So basically what happened is it's all on the um, Nike members app which is free to anyone so definitely got to get on that. Um, so open up the Nike app and basically on like my account um, here you can see I liked it it's like first access so member exclusive shop so these first shoes were only available to people on the app and they were only op available on the 5th and the 6th so you had to either get them Monday or Tuesday now you can't get them anymore and they sold out so this is the first colorway they show you a couple pictures and then if you go to shoes, here's the sh they're coming out with two more colorways on um, February 22nd. So you can get this college navy, but same shoe, just with the pink and blue in the back. Um, and so they actually didn't say what time they were going to release the shoe on Monday. So I was kept checking back on the app, but they really wouldn't say the time. So I actually got on... Um, like where it says you can chat an expert. Okay, I don't think because it's like okay, 10 p.m. on a Saturday, the um, live chat people they have on the Nike app like aren't available right now. But basically, I went on there and like got on the chat, and this guy, I think his name was Xavier, he basically helped me, and I said, "Hey, I'm really trying to get these shoes today. Like, what time are they coming?" And he said, oh, "We don't know, but I'll let you know that they're gonna be soon." He said, I'll, I can keep an ear to the ground and um, I'll send you a message when they come out. So basically, I got to have the guy in the app message me right when they came out because they sold out pretty quickly. Um, and he messaged me and said, hey, here's the link. They're available. So I got right on when I got the message and ordered them, which is cool of him for be able to do that. And then the last cool thing about the shoes before we get into the actual shoe is when you order, this pair of shoes came with... Um, four free months of Apple Music. Like, I got a little code with the shoes when I order it, so that's awesome, too. I always use Spotify, but I'd be willing to try Apple Music, so we'll see. And, yeah, you can see on the screen here, up to four months of Apple Music, feel your run, get promo code, redeem. Yeah, so that's super cool. Okay, so now if we go ahead and take a look and, like, actually get into um, the Nike React as a shoe... So basically the Nike React is Nike's latest um, technology in running and it's really meant to be a competitor to Adidas's Boost foam cushioning. So there's a lot of debate up right now like which shoe is comfier. So this is definitely meant to be constructed for flexibility and breathability in mind. My first reaction to these was definitely like okay these are fresh straight out of the box and that's because of the colorway like the all white. There's nothing better than an all-white, brand-new pair of shoes. So I'll say it's definitely going to be hard to keep these clean, but when they're clean, they look good. Um, the shoe is really flexible. It's definitely more, like, historically, like, a, say, a free-run shoe. So that's typically more, not, like, more. my everyday type of shoe. So I'm definitely going to be wearing this differently than a lot of my sneakers. But they're definitely cool, and I can appreciate how lightweight they are. And it's really like a sock. You'll notice in these that I'm not wearing socks when I put them on, and that's because, like, they're pretty tight, like the sock definitely gets bunched up when you try and slide your foot into these with, with socks on, so I'm not sure how much I'll be wearing them with or without socks, but for now, um, when I'm not actually like working out in them yet, I definitely like the feel of them better without socks on. One last uh, power move I feel like is worth mentioning with these shoes is um, Roger Federer. So he just won the Australian Open, and he didn't play in these shoes. He played like in his own you know, vapor tennis shoes he has or whatever. Um, but after he won, he came out to get the trophy and he was wearing the these shoes in the colorway that comes out on the 22nd. Kind of like Justin Timberlake wearing those Tinker Hatfield Jordans at the Super Bowl halftime show. I feel like both of those are a couple nice power moves Nike has made recently in the shoe world just to um, get some of their new shoes out there.